78 attacks were carried out on military bases in the Middle East. Deputy Pentagon Press Secretary Sabrina Singh from the Pentagon has disclosed the number of wounded resulting from attacks by militants on U.S. military bases in the Middle East, according to the U.S. Department of Defense. According to her, as of December the 7th, approximately 78 attacks were carried out on U.S. military bases. Singh also provided information about the wounded. According to her, the number was around 66 military personnel. As of December the 4th, it's still about 66 of our folks who have received non-serious, non-life-threatening injuries and all who have returned to work, Singh said. U.S. military bases in the Middle East are regularly subjected to shelling from Iraq and Syria. The active phase intensified after the Hamas militants' attack on Israel. It was reported that militants recently attacked a U.S. military base with 15 missiles. Fortunately, there were no casualties. In late October, due to drone attacks on U.S. bases in Iraq and Syria, 20 people were injured. In response, the U.S. launched strikes on two Iranian targets in Syria. Against the backdrop of these strikes on bases in early November, Secretary of State Antony Blinken visited Iraq.